Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. It's me Antonio back with another video today. Making sure everybody's um doing okay today. We're continuing with the um the seven uh deadly sins series. I wanted to shoot this video in my room, but we got a concert going on in La Casa right now, so out on my front porch. Um but yeah, so we already did um you know we started from the ground up, I guess. Um gluttony and then we're when we went up to lust and then and of course we did sloth and now moving past sloth we get up to the heart chakra oh, i'm sorry not the heart chakra but the we get up to pride so yeah i guess that spirit saying we're going to be comparing <laughs> we're going to be comparing um pride to the heart chakra which it makes sense you know when you think about um pride you think about you know, you think about yourself, uh, you think about going inward, you think about manifesting, um, you know, everything that you, uh, you know, want to want to manifest, you don't really take it into account of what, you know, other people feel or how other people think or anything like that. It's a very, um, you know, prideful moment. You feel proud of yourself. You feel, you know, whether, and that's the thing, you can have a false sense of accomplishment. So, you know, whether you've accomplished something or not, you can be overconfident, you can be over... You know, some people even have, uh, you know, imposter syndrome where they feel like, you know, they don't even deserve what they accomplish. You know, that's that's your equilibrium and your chakra networks thrown off. You know, your your heart chakra is thrown off or you're feeling, you know, that's that sinful uh, spirit of pride has come over you where you see so much of yourself that you can't even take outside criticism or influences or anything like that. Now, again, with all these energies, whether it's good or bad, you can always bend it to your benefit um you know there's certain uh animate and inanimate things that binds themselves to these types of energies you know there's a reason why god did not want to have people worshiping idols you know idols um you know living idols tend to manifest pride even inanimate objects you know you'd be su uh, surprised uh, how living uh, how alive these things are a tree is alive you know, when the, when the wind moves it, the branches and the, and the leaves, they move. You know, even rocks. You know, there's been documentaries on rocks moving across the desert over time. You know, so there's always, you know, energies affecting things in, in different kinds of ways. So, yeah, just be mindful of, um, you know, yourself. You know, the, the heart chakra is, you know, again, one of the most important parts of your body you know if or energies in your body you know if you know um the root chakra was is the wheels of the car to get you driving around of course you need the heart you need the heart to be in a uh constant positive state of mind it helps you manifest you know being too prideful you know people you know look at you weird sometimes if if you know you're being too prideful you know people can not want to do things for for you or they could not want to be around you or you know arrogance you know uh, arrogance comes with a lot of um with a lot of pride with a lot of uh off and imbalanced heart chakra you know these feelings again and it's all it, and it's, it has a lot about a lot a lot to do with you know the feelings you know you have fear uh the lowest uh emotion on the on the uh emotional spectrum and then you have love and then you have everything in the middle of it, whether it's good or bad. You can be, you know, you can hate, you can hate someone, you know, or you can you can envy them <laughs> or love them more. Different, just different things. So, depending on those, those different spectrums, you can manifest different types of energy. You know. Uh, but that's all I wanted to talk to you guys today. We are about halfway done with the seven deadly sins. Um, and yeah, just be mindful of you know yourself. You know, if you don't have anything to be proud about, if you haven't accomplished anything in life, not saying that, you know, accomplishments or everything and titles and labels don't have their place in the world. Um, but, yeah, of course, your 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 confidence uh, should come from within. That frequency of love should come from within. You shouldn't. Uh oh, maybe getting jiggy with it out here. You feel me? Um, but, yeah, so just stay just stay positive. Stay on. Um, an equal equilibrium of your your heart chakra. You know you don't want to be over emotional. You don't want to seem like 
a dud, like a dud firecracker, you know. You know, we don't need the, the heart energy going stagnant. We don't need the heart to stop. Or we don't need the heart, you know, um, you know, overexerting itself. You know, again, w watching the things that you put into your body, what you see, think, you know, what you hear. All these types of things affects, affects your overall uh, chakra networks, the systems and the energies and the arc fields around you. And, um, you know, stay blessed, you know. Make sure that... Um, taking your chakra baths you're taking at least that time out of the day whether it's five or ten minutes just to think for a second think about what stand in place look down at your feet and think about what you're standing on look up in the air and think about what you're looking at try and free your mind try to release stress try to make sure everything around you is you know try to make sure that your body is balanced so yeah that's all i had to say about um you know, that's all I had to say about the, the, the one of the seven deadly sins, pride, uh, equating it or uh, contrasting it with uh, the heart chakra. Um, so, yeah, be safe. I'll be continuing on to the next uh, topic on my next video. Uh, it'll be, I guess, continuing with the trend. I guess it'll be Vashuda. One of the things that I'm good at that I've mastered. <laughs> Um, the throat chakra um, but yeah we'll get there um, be safe continue to you know study and expand your knowledge I'll catch you guys on the next one